what we're doing here is training our members to uh, basically evaluate the structure, uh, the structures, going into a, an actual house using the blower door that you see behind me, and basically um, find the air leaks, the problem areas in the actual structure, find out how we can basically stop the airflow from leaving our, our house through the air leaks, um, trying to tighten up our, our actual structures. Um, we're also teaching them, you know, the proper materials and, and the safety aspect of, you know, the proper installation practices that are uh, industry standards for the materials that are going to be being used. What we teach here is basically how to come up with um, how leaky a house is. Uh, every house is going to be leaking some air. Um, what every house needs is some fresh air also. So the old saying used to be the house has to breathe and it's not really the house that has to breathe, it's the occupants that have to breathe. Um, the old houses, you know, anywhere from 50 plus years old, are extremely leaky. They're very uh, energy inefficient. Um, some of the greenest things that the homeowner can possibly do is right there in their house. Stop the air leaks. Our certified energy analyst will come in there, determine how much air is actually leaking, how much air should be leaking, or if we want to get it uh, tight enough, bring in some mechanical ventilation so they can control, rather than getting that air from the actual crawl space or basement, they can control where that air is coming from. They're going to be getting fresh air rather than musty air um, that they're going to be breathing in the house. Um, with that, they're going to be able to uh, use the software that they'll be inputting information that they take measurements from the house, evaluating the house, enter the information in the software programs, and it'll have a breakdown on what would be the most cost-effective, energy-efficient um, methods that they could put in there and would save the customer um, hundreds of dollars up to thousands of dollars on their energy bills because now they're not going to be conditioning, they're not going to be reheating the air that's uh, going through the house constantly. Uh, the, once the certified energy analyst gets in there and he does his audit and he finds the, the locations of the, the problem areas, he comes up with his work scope and going to have the uh, homeowner you know, get the work done by a signatory contractor. He's going to go in there, do industry standard work. Um, do everything proper, making sure that he doesn't do any harm to the actual structure or to the actual occupants, um, such as making the house too tight or causing a problem with the, the, the furnaces or the water heaters and causing a backdraft problem. And they're going to be saving money because when they go to uh, heat the house, they've had our, our signatory contractors tighten up the house, control the air leakage, bring that air leakage down to a minimum. So now, rather than the utility bills being extremely high during the winter time, because their, their bills are high because of the fact that when they heat the house, heat, they heat up the air, the house gets about 70 degrees, and all that 70 degree air that they just heated up now goes through all the holes in the house. What happens is, is now that house is getting makeup air, the cold air from the outside that's being sucked in which that has to be reheated up to 70 degrees. Here in Chicago, with it being you know, anywhere from 20, 10, zero, even below zero, they're gonna have to heat up that zero degree temperature air up to 70 degrees each time. We stop the air leaks, that 70 degree air now is gonna come back through the return, go through the furnace again at anywhere from you know, 50, 60 degrees, they're not going to be using as, as much energy to have to heat that air that's already 50, 60 degrees compared to having to heat it up from zero up to 70. The carpenter itself, we know how the house goes together. Um, no matter if it's a 100-year-old house or brand new house, we know how the house is built. We know we can take a look at the, the house. We know how the floor is going to be put into place. We can tell where there's going to be drop ceilings, what the soffit's going to look like behind there because we've built the stuff. It's going to be easier for us to actually get in there and, and quickly do the work, do it efficiently, and save the, the, the homeowner extra money by not being in the house for days at end. 
we're going to be able to find the problems quickly. We know what we're looking for. Uh, we know how to fix the house, and we know how to do it correctly. Meaning that we're not going to go up there and, and cut some trusses and potentially cause a roof failure. We're, gonna, we're not going to pull out some support beams to get our material in there when it could cause some problems. We know how the house is constructed. We know how it's put together. We're able to take that knowledge and what we're doing is, is conserving time. And again, time time's money. So we're actually going to be taking less time to do the work because we know how the house is constructed. Uh, it's helped the school by being able to purchase extra equipment. Um, that way we can run more classes. Uh, we've got grant money to run extra classes, bring in uh, more people from uh, different contractors that we, uh, that we have. Um, we're also able to uh, do more classes with the equipment, uh, possibly rent out the equipment that we are, are going to be obtaining. Right now we just have the one piece of equipment um, and the cost is, is kind of high for the equipment. In the grant money, we're able to buy uh, five extra sets, which is gonna give five extra contractors you know, the equipment without having the initial cost of the equipment until they get established um, doing this work in the industry. Uh, I can be reached at the Carpenter Training Center, um, Elk Grove Village. Number there is 847-640-7373. Uh, you may have to leave a message. I'll get back as soon as possible.